They're good ones. That's cool. They're uh, Brazilian. Really? Brazilian? Yeah, yeah, they're from like the late 50s, early 60s. Huh. They're good ones. And you have to your dinosaurs. My dinosaurs. I told them they're early, well, late 50s. Yeah, I just 60s. looked them up. They're really cool. They came from Brazil. And I just found them online. I figured when I bought them, they were decent. Right. What did I tell you? I don't remember. Was it 40 for the pair? For the pair, yeah. yeah for the pair. 40 for the pair. For the I pair. love them, and they're in exceptional yeah, condition. Yeah, they are. Yeah. I'll think about it. I think we'd kick that one. They'll, yeah. they're, they're my thing tomorrow. I think someone's going to buy pretty quick. You mind if I look at that butter? That's an original one. Let me check this guy out. That's the one that doesn't say now. Huh. That's the original. Wow. From, is it 1991. That's really nice. That's an original. Whoa. How much are you asking on... How much? On this one. On that one? Yeah. 75. 75. Five dollars for that whole thing. This seems uh, legit. Storm King. Is that a Zippo? No, Storm King. I've oh. heard of it. Still looking for a brass Zippo. God, look at all this stuff. My goodness gracious. This is like oh. Are they real? I don't know. They're made in Italy. I don't know. What about them? Pin. Forty bucks. Forty bucks. Look at this thing. Look at that thing. All right, we're stepping our game up tomorrow. They don't. Yeah, we got some good stuff we can bring. Here, you see the guy at the mall. I'm pretty sure. Ten dollars? No, forty-five. Oh, ten and a half. Ten and a half. I'm buying them all for ten dollars. <laughs> no, 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 no. Like, how do you know that's real? Christian Duar? Who knows? $100 for a Fendi? I thought that said 60. Oh, it does say 60. Or 100. They just kept the blue. That's a lot of wrenches. with you. 40 bucks. what I got on that ten dollars you get ten bucks yeah there's another lens in so, oh okay but yeah it's ten dollars for everything I'll take it for ten okay I looked it up and they sell for good money but with cameras you know I don't know if it works sure sure yeah I'm not a camera guy <laughs> 
I'll take it for 10 bucks. What else you got here? A lot of everything. <laughs> Get what? There's a lot of expensive stuff in here like this is all case knives oh yeah these two are case that's cool these are cool i don't know if that's a real one How are you today? I'm good. I don't have a chair. Yeah, I have a chair. If you want to try those on. What size are nine and a half? Six bucks and take them home. Six them. bucks? I will. Yeah. You have a great day. Thanks. Oh, five. five. It's early in the morning. Heck no, I was going to keep them for myself. <laughs> I do six. You're a tough bargainer there. I know. You can sell them, you can sell them for 25. I think it's cool. There's some cool things here. I like things off cars. I actually have sold a uh, Cadillac. Kind of like, I have card holders. Yeah. Yep. Sold one. Got one more to sell. Pretty cool. Cadillac. <laughs> for a long time oh my goodness they did didn't they jeez i was just looking at that going oh, wow they had to retire from it they probably, they yeah i don't know i hope so This is more of the overview on this side. Definitely a ton of people here. It's gonna be interesting to see exactly how many people leave with stuff or sell everything they have. Sold okay. that guy before. Together. I like the the gopher head cover. It's good. <laughs> it's like the one off a of Caddyshack. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, that's, like the one yeah. Exactly. You said it kind of goes, right? It does. Hey, cat mom. For your mom. Mm. Right done. She's got a cat. Got cat houses okay. under there too, and cat things. Yeah, she. She has a cat. No. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Dollar, three dollar, twenty five dollars. Expensive. I don't know, four dollars a hat for the right hat, right? I don't think uh, these were the right hats though. next day here and this is the only thing that i bought at the biggest yard sale ever not because there wasn't things to find this is the only stuff that i could actually 
remember or that was just so overwhelming there with the amount of stuff and this is like where my knowledge is you know some boots and a camera so let's go ahead and go over this real quick this olympus om10 camera it does have the olympus lens on it is the reason why i bought it if it had a different lens i probably wouldn't have bought it but it does have the Olympus lens right there, and it's in good condition. Uh, I really probably won't test this out just because that this does sell for about $50 for parts with that lens. I only paid 10 bucks for it, so I'm gonna go ahead and just sell it like for parts as is and probably make about 50 plus shipping on that. And then this one right here is gonna be just uh, the other lens that was in the bag. It's a Gemini, which is not a good brand. I think this one goes for about 20 bucks plus shipping, so not terrible there. So that one right there would be all profits. I'll probably make $50 super, super fast. And these right here are some lizard and leather skin, nice looking brown boots, happen to be in uh, my size, which is nice. I could clean these things up and probably keep them, but I'll probably go ahead and sell them. None of that actually sold on eBay, but they're all listed. There's only two listed and they're listed for $89.99. I only picked them up for six bucks, which is a really good deal. And uh, so I'm probably gonna go ahead and post them on there for about 65 bucks plus shipping and then take a best offer around 50 bucks. So I spent $16 and this is probably about $100 worth of items. Not terrible, if that was in working order, they go for about 100 bucks. Uh, but uh, as you saw, I did miss the jet ski telephone right next to me. I think he was asking like 10 bucks for that or five bucks and it goes for 75 to $50. So it wasn't because there wasn't deals to be had. I just didn't have the knowledge to get the deals and that's in this business, Knowledge is money, so the more knowledge you can get, the more money you can make where you're out there picking. Now let's go over all the stickers that I have received which will end up on the toolbox today. First, Coco and Chewy, awesome sticker right here. Thank you so much, a sticker is coming to you. Judy, thank you so much for all the stickers that you sent. This one right here is for your eBay store, Fair Sunrise Store. Also, two little foxes right there and the coolest sticker in the world right here. It's got a turtle and an alligator. All right, thank you so much, Judy, for our stickers. One is heading your way. Then this one right here is from Miss Eva. Got some thank you stickers and hang loose from Missouri. Absolutely going on the toolbox, so thank you so much. So thank you so much, Tammy. This is actually her daughter's company logo from Army Basic Training, so awesome, and thank you so much. When you see her, thank her for her service from me. That is awesome. Eastwood sticker, and these right here are made by her husband, and it's from Fourfold Metalworks, and he has a uh, website, fourfoldmetalworks.com, and they are, like, made of metal. I mean, they're, like, hard. They're, they're very heavy-duty, and they are magnets. Boom. So you got Sasquatch and a bird and i'm gonna go ahead and put this actually this one's probably gonna go on the refrigerator but one might go up there because it look good on the red so i'm thinking maybe this one out here and maybe that one on the refrigerator so tammy thank you so much for all this stuff and all these will end up there today so to go ahead and thank some people for buying us coffees ernie and michelle thank you so much for buying us coffees marie thank you for buying us coffees also maria Thank you for buying us coffees. If you don't know what that is, there's a link down below. It's basically where you can uh, tip one of your favorite YouTubers and we much appreciate it. Also, the beard is almost done. We're missing lights on it, but the bear, the wall just looks so bare without the big beard on it. And Kayla made this, she drew it, I cut it out, and we're gonna go ahead and put some cool lights on the back of it. And, uh, and the backdrop is we're gonna fill this wall up with a whole bunch of stuff that y'all have sent us, uh, some dinosaur stuff, so it's gonna be really, really awesome. I do appreciate everybody that's been watching these videos we really can't do all this stuff without y'all watching it. So we really do thank you. And you know I will always get you on the next one.